Hello Fluffy Tales, I'm the Serious Squirrel and welcome back to Alan Wake. In the last episode we finally arrived at the power station and met Cynthia the Wee Wee Cynthia Weaver. Cynthia Weaver. I'm gonna practice that a little bit more. And heard that Sheriff Breaker and Barry are in a peril, so probably they're over there. Where the burning uh, thing is. And I could get over there and must get over there because there is no other way than here. And those birds are dead. Oh, I can't. I just didn't look enough. Alright. Alrighty ho. Uh, so many birds. I really don't... Hey! You... Mother trucking birds. Uh, jump down here. Kill the birds. At least it's only birds. Can manage with the birds. Don't like the shadow people. If I'm honest. Hmm. The crash site looked bad, but as far as I could tell, the wreck was empty. Well, I knew that they would survive. It was kind of obvious. At least I hoped that they would survive because Barry is awesome and Sheriff Breaker is usable. I maybe shouldn't have said that like this. You know, you know Sheriff Breaker is kind of a dull character, but... She's a good sidekick. The well-lit room. I can only guess that... Oh! Barry! Barry! Stay where you are, people! I'm coming! Die, bitches! One, two, three... Okay! Nice! Got rid of most of them! You die, sucker! And then we kill Walter White. Okay. See, we did it. I have a different ending in mind. Yeah, I'm fine. Thanks for asking. I knew you'd be all right. How's that? The flaming eye of Mordor. Ah, laugh it up, funny man. Didn't we have somewhere to go? We <laughs> will meet us at the dam. And there is the creepy breathing again, which tells me that there is some kind of thing that I can use. There it is. Awesome. What's in it? Rifle ammo. Okay. Take it. I take it. Uh, those guys follow... Yeah, they, they are following me. Okay, perfect. Sorry if my commentary kind of sucks. I'm a little bit rusty because there was such a long break in between those episodes. And I kind of have to get into the groove again. Nice. You should be a rider too, Barry. Bullshit. I should have kept that gym membership. You probably should have. See those lights? That's the elevator we need to take. Oh, perfect. Just uphill where we have to fight through all kinds of big people. Hey. That's Barry? Ah, Al, do something. Yeah, I'm trying to. He's too fast. I can't get a shot. 
I'm trying to do something, you know? Please, Barry. Keep your cool. One down. Two down. Don't wet your pants. Was that it? Are we safe? Yep. Was, wow. I think we're okay. I guess I missed the page over there, but hey, Al, you know. I got a bad feeling. Let's keep our eyes open. Oh man. Oh Barry. Come on. Suck it up. Wait, call the elevator. I'm keeping watch. I think I hear something moving around. Uh yeah. I can't hear something moving around, but there's probably something moving around. Uh before I call the elevator, I'm going to check everywhere. No, there is nothing. Barry looks fancy. Let's call the elevator. Which takes a long ass time and we of course have to fight off some more of those dudes. I see that sheriff. You know it's pretty obvious. People are coming at us. Where's the elevator? Of course it takes a long time and we have to fight some more. But that's okay, that's why we're here for. Nobody? Ow. Yeah. Ellen should really think about riding some faster elevators into the world. It really help everyone. One, two, three, four, five, six! Damn it! There we go. Alright, let's get in. Light. I love light. Yeah, I know. I pressed the button. Don't be such a crybaby, Barry. Of course, the elevator takes a lot less time. A lot less. A lot less. I don't know if that's right. But... It's of course faster when you go up. Because there is nothing you have to fight. Okay, where do we go, Sheriff? Okay, wait. There's a button over there that opens the door. Okay. Why is the button so far away? Can you tell me? You're probably not going to tell me, right? The well-lit room. Um, let's look around first, because there is creepy breathing again. And I usually hate creepy breathing. There is a page over there. Can I get over there? Does not look like it. Maybe when I go around this? Can I go around? No, I can't. Why is there a page? Why is there a page when I can't get it? I don't like that. Alright, let's, let's push the button. The pages are getting harder to get. I think something's broken. Hold the button down so we can get in. Of course, I'm going to hold the button down. So you can get in, and I have to fight my way around. That's probably how I will. I will get to that page. You guys go ahead and find Weaver. She should be in the dam now. I'll have to make it alone through the top. Okay, 
Yeah, you take good care of him. I know you two are lovers. That's how I got the page. All right. Perfect. It was kind of obvious, wasn't it? It's always like that in this game. All right, okay. Let's get the pitch. That's why we're here for. Okay, uh, shoebox. Thomas Zane knew he had to remove all that had made this horror possible, including himself. That was the only way to banish the dark presence he had unleashed and now looked at him through the eyes of his dead love. But he also knew that despite his best efforts, it might someday return. So even as he wrote himself and his work out of existence, he added a loophole as insurance, an exception to the rule. Anything of his stored in a shoebox would remain. Okay. So his books, basically. Because we saw the uh, shoebox with Thomas Sane books. Oh, that looks like a safe point, and I really like that. I really like that. There we go, checkpoint reached. Perfect. Well, the way to the dam wasn't. I really should shut my goddamn mouth once. Just when I wanted to say, we got to the dam easily, this happens. It's almost like I can't see the future. Or maybe the game is just predictable, but I like it. Well lit room, upstairs. Why <clears throat> would you write that here? Maybe because it's obvious that we have to go there. Oh. What? Oh. I was ridiculously outnumbered. The searchlight could even the odds. Yep. Boost. There we go. I mean, I have fought that amount of guys before, so I don't know. Can I, can I use this one, please? First, this guy. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna kill you without the... Searchlight. Can I use the searchlight, please? Thank you! Thank you! Killed that guy. There are some more over there. We are going to kill with the boost. And now the... What? Okay. Fluffy Tales! What do you say if we end the episode right here? Because this looks like something I have to run from and I really don't want to start that right now. So you have to wait until the next episode to see what is going to happen in Alan Wake. Fluffy Tales, I hope you had fun watching this episode. Come back in the next one and as always I leave you with Artie. Goodbye. Goodbye.